With Wednesday's County Zoning Commission vote, a luxury housing development on Blue Diamond Hill is all but a done deal. But opponents tell us they're going to keep up the fight. I don't want to get emotional, but it means a lot to a lot of people. That's Heather Fisher of the conservation organization Save Red Rock. She made her appeal to county commissioners just before they voted 6-0 to zero Wednesday to approve Gypsum Resources' plan for a luxury housing development on Blue Diamond Hill. The commission agreeing to change the area's zoning from a rural open land zone to a master-planned community development zone. We are heartbroken to witness this stage of the process where the county has been backed into a corner. That motion passes. The vote, which Commissioner Justin Jones abstained from, was one of the final hurdles left for Gypsum, developer Jim Rhodes' company. Along with altering some scenic views in the area, members of Save Red Rock and some Blue Diamond residents we've talked to in recent months worry about congestion. Caron Hagerty worries about what we could soon see on State Road 159. Additional traffic endangers wildlife, cyclists, nature lovers, and all those who seek the solace of the most visited national conservation area in the United States. A 20-year legal battle between Gypsum and Clark County culminated last month in an $80 million settlement, a massive victory for Gypsum. Rhodes was at Wednesday morning's meeting but declined our interview request. As for Fisher, she chalks up the vote as a setback. Well, we only have one Red Rock and we have a lot of random desert and we have a lot of infill in the city that can be developed. But she's not ready to throw in the towel. We're talking to um, experts about what to do next and we're just going to have to keep consulting and keep trying and keep fighting and, and just never give up. An attorney for the developer says the new Hilltop community will include a brand new elementary school and a fire station. Reporting from the Clark County Government Center, I'm Brian Horwath.